The I hear you, Karen. Go ahead. You're on the air. The former president pleaded not guilty to 34 counts of falsifying business records in the first degree. Those are all felony counts. The prosecutor said that this was part of a conspiracy that started in 2015 and involved the payment of at least $130,000 to Stormy Daniels. Um, as part of the, the allegations, prosecutor said that this was part of an effort to promote his candidacy by burying negative stories ahead of the election. And now, we don't have all the additional details of what else might be included in this, but that is how they outlined it in court. Now, in this, in this brief, well, it was about a 45-minute arraignment, when the former president entered the room, it was so quiet you could hear a pin drop. He walked in, he licked his lips. He was scanning each of the rows filled with press. There were about 60 members of the press in there, each row flanked by court security officers. Uh, we were not allowed to use any electronic devices, so we've all have kind of been filing out now to report the news. Um, he spoke only a few times. He entered the plea not guilty on his own. He also was addressed by the judge um, who addressed to him some of the threatening statements that he made. That was something that prosecutors had raised. They had asked the judge not to impose any kind of gag order, but just to raise the potential issues of Trump's threatening social media posts. They handed up copies of those posts to the court and to Trump. Uh, the judge said that he was not going to impose any kind of gag order. He said it, he wouldn't, it, even if he was asked right now, but he did warn the former and also the prosecutors to warn their witnesses to tamp down their rhetoric to reduce what they are saying about the case. And, re and the judge warned both sides, but particularly speaking to former President Trump, not to make any statements that would incite any violence or threats against any officials. You know, the former president has forgotten the judge.